A leader in the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints has apologized for comments he made regarding black members of the church during an event over the weekend. Brad R. Wilcox is the second counselor in the Young Men General Presidency. He was speaking Sunday at a stake youth fireside. It was in Alpine. The controversial comments came when Wilcox talked about questions he receives about how long it took to end the prohibition against blacks in the priesthood. Now, I don't mean to oversimplify a complex issue, but I sure think we make it a little harder than it needs to be. How come the blacks didn't get the priesthood until 1978? What's up with that, Brother Wilcox? What, Brigham Young was a jerk? Members of the church were prejudiced? Maybe we're asking the wrong question. Maybe instead of saying, why did the blacks have to wait until 1978? Maybe what we should be asking is, why did the whites and other races have to wait until 1829? Well, Wilcox apologized on Facebook, saying he, quote, made a serious mistake. And he added his statements were meant to express something about trusting God's timing. Today, Brigham Young University, where Wilcox is a professor of ancient scripture, released a statement saying, in part, we are deeply concerned with the words recently used by Dr. Brad Wilcox. We appreciate his sincere apology and believe he is committed to learn from the experience. They added, we are carrying out the guiding principles outlined by President Worthen in evaluating and implementing the recommendations provided by the Committee on Race, Equity, and Belonging, including the creation of a new Office of Belonging.